Well, I'm here tonight with a little bit of breaking news, nothing major, but something pretty cool. Real quick though, if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to the channel as we continue to post content regularly, especially when there's breaking news. We try to get that out to you as quickly as possible, like tonight. So this update today is gonna be a pretty quick one, but it is kind of exciting for some of you, although others might think it's kind of lame but I'm in the camp that says, I think it's pretty cool. I wanna thank the sponsor of this video, Phantom Wallet. Phantom Wallet offers premium wallet designs with an aluminum chassis with options of wood, leather, and carbon fiber finishes. Grab the cards you need with a quick flip of the lever, RFID and NFC protection are built in, ensuring a safe and secure alternative to traditional options. Make sure to use code BTG to save 10% on your order. So we're finding out from Tesla owners online via Twitter that the pedestrian warning system that was released not that long ago in Tesla Model 3s and Model Ys, that is now going to be able to be a retro upgrade for existing cars that did not have the speaker. Now there are some parameters around this, so some cars will qualify and some will not. However, if you have a Model Y, you will qualify if you do not have that speaker already. All Model Ys before August 14th will be able to be retrofitted. And for Model 3s, that's going to be between July 5th of 2019 through September of 2020. So if you have a Model 3 or a Model Y in any of those ranges, you are able to get this retrofit done. This retrofit is only gonna be able to be done by Tesla because of the configuration that needs to occur in the car, but they're going to be able to add that speaker. Anything after this date already had the speaker installed and was ready to go. Before, it just had the wiring. So that wiring is there, so all they have to do is hook up the speaker and then set the code in the car. So what this is going to do is Tesla either at the service center or we're hearing possibly a mobile technician can come out and do this upgrade for you. It's going to be 200 bucks. And that may sound like an unreasonable number for some and a reasonable number for others. I personally think 200 bucks to add a speaker is not too bad. And here's why. It's not just because it has the pedestrian warning system. It's the fun you can have with it. Of course, when this finally was activated in cars that had the speaker, we saw countless videos of people making their car fart next to people at the sidewalk, laughing, having a good time. And then of course, the countless Star Wars theme songs that you can load onto a thumb drive and have it play in your pedestrian warning system. I am for sure going to have this done to the car as soon as I possibly can. So this is new, this is fresh. We don't know exactly the timeline. However, it appears that people are able to schedule their appointments now. To do this, you're gonna, of course, schedule your appointment in the app. And you're going to need to reference SI-21-90-001. And this is to let the service center know what they need to reference on their end to know what to have done to your car. Now, eventually this will be widespread and they'll know exactly what needs to be done. But for now, reference that number and then they should know exactly what to do to your car. As this is indeed the last day of April, we are now moving into May and we are expecting a number of updates. So be sure to subscribe because we're going to be sharing those updates as they become available. Of course, we're waiting for the full self-driving subscription model to come out, which we're very excited about. We still don't know pricing. We still don't know exactly when. However, that should be in the month of May. We also have other updates that we're anticipating. So as soon as that stuff happens, we'll be breaking that on this channel. So again, if you haven't already, of course, subscribe to the channel. You can also follow us on Twitter and Instagram. Thanks so much for joining us and we'll catch you next time.